in terms of the learning experience very similarly once you can gather data about your specific learners uh, you can also use AI to build specific programs that are geared for that specific learner and the nuances regarding that learner. As employers, right, so as employers we understand that people don't learn the same way. Uh, we understand that people don't learn at the same pace. Um, and also from the fast-paced environment that we deal with in terms of remaining internationally competitive, also, the speed of learning is becoming incredibly important. And we're dealing with very complex concepts out there. So, you know, you can't take months and months to upskill a person to do a job, right? We have to find more effective ways. And artificial intelligence creates the enablement for learners uh, to have different learning experience based on very personal needs, but also organizational needs, and deal with uh, the effectiveness of learning. And I think we should determine the outcomes that we want to achieve by introducing AI. And it's not about just uh, uh, you know, giving people tons of information. It's about the, the concept of what do we need people to know uh, and how do we make that most productive and effective in a way that people enjoy and get to love the learning experience. With the revolution of open AI, as you mentioned earlier, when that came about, I thought this is an ideal opportunity for me to enroll into university and potentially use generative AI to help augment potentially any learning deficit that I might have had. Mm -hmm. So I joined another international university. Um, at AWS, we, we leverage foundational models to build out our own generative AI capabilities in a secure and responsible way, protecting my personal data, etc. I leveraged, leveraged as much data as I could in terms of my learning styles, my learning preferences, my strengths and weaknesses, my academic performance. Started to put that into a foundational model called Claude within Amazon. Started to train a supervised model that could help preempt and predict what sort of personal learning experience and how I should navigate through the curriculum. Um, and ultimately that led to me being a lot more engaged, a lot more focused, piqued my curiosity a lot more in terms of building out my own learning. So it wasn't just a leveraging the services just to get the data, but actually promoting a longer-term learning and personal experience for myself.